Broadcasting from the greatest castle in the world, in the County of Lawrence, NCTV 45. One to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. Vinte Se, a fine winery located in Newcastle, Pennsylvania, on Newcastle's southeast side, Wilson Avenue, provided funding for this program. Vinte Se. The Crane Room is a restaurant. The Crane Room is a bar. The Crane Room is a banquet facility. The restaurant will please you time after time with their diverse menu. Ask about their daily specials. See the menu at craneroom.com. The bar gives you an abundance of choices with 35 beers on tap and always changing. Their banquet services are always to perfection. The Crane Room, located at 3009 Wilmington Road in Ashanic Township. Call 724-656-1553. NC TV 45 Newcastle The Train Well, good morning there friends as uh we uh get to Newswatch morning and a um, little bit of a challenging morning as um, as we arrived at the station reported that Comcast uh, had an outage in their services which as you know would affect us <laughs> and um, it did and so that's why Newswatch is delayed about an hour uh, from when you would regularly pick it up. Um, as far as, uh, and as we give you that first look at weather, as far as that goes, dry all night. And then as we got to daybreak, out popped the scattered showers and... Um, that was interesting because just as we get getting in the car, we got that rain. It's 61 and overcast in Newcastle as uh, you're getting up, rising around, maybe having your coffee, and we're glad you're spending it with us. NCTV 45. Today we're getting up to a cloudy high of 72. We'll have more for you on that when we get to Lawrence County 45 weather and um, let's take off and get you kind of with the top stories today and um, first of all remember as you go through this weekend there are a lot of activities around and the state and the and PennDOT have done their click it or ticket and uh, they're going to be offering uh, <laughs> a ticket if you're not buckled up. This is kind of a warning thing as they get into the summer months. And uh, keep in mind, schools are starting to let out a lot more people out and around. And be aware of that. As reported yesterday, cardboard box packing and sealing going to Luzerne County. Uh, and we're looking, still looking for that uh, governor to put a plan out here. Uh, wouldn't be a bad thing. Now, um, 
In other news, uh, a grant was received by Giant Eagle, $660,000. The Wolf Administration is expanding routes for clean fuel drivers. That means if you have an electric car or um, uh, one that runs on the, the gas, natural gas, well, you're going to be able to fill up in certain places, but interesting enough, the only one on this side of the state is Interstate 70 from the Ohio border to the intersection with the Turnpike. And uh, so uh, not that many corridors happening over here, although there are some companies that are selling electric cars right there in Cranberry, just a few miles down the road, so uh, be aware of that. You know, last night, it, it became abundantly aware to me on just how many activities we have going on this weekend. So I didn't want to be remiss in missing any of them. We've been talking about these activities all week as it's been a plethora okay if you would <coughs> of activities so as we go through I'm going to put out some reminders the library is closed today there will be no library stitcher meeting one number two down at the historic Warner Theater they do have that movie taking off uh, on World War II with the traveling uh, World War II exhibit. Keep in mind that tonight at the Scottish Rite Cathedral from 7 to 11 it's the 2019 Western Pennsylvania Patriot Bash. So if you're going that way expect there to be some crowds. On Saturday Remember that there's Garden Mart at Cascade Park. Flowers, vegetable plants, hanging baskets, soil testing, garden info, fun crafts, breakfast, lunch, and baked goods. Make sure you're aware of just, just those few things going on that I wanted. I talked about them at the beginning of the week. Okay, and I can't keep repeating every day, but I try and keep you up so you don't forget because I know sometimes you're doing this, you're busy, and you might forget. Now, um, what we're going to do is I'm going to take a walk. We're going to hear from these fine sponsors, and then we're going to go to sports, and when we come back, I have a lot more of this stuff that's just come in it's brand new fresh and you got to know it and uh, we'll get to weather so uh, let's take this break and hear from these great sponsors and then we'll be right back If you're craving hot dogs and more, and you're in the area, then look no farther than Coney Island, downtown Newcastle, on Kennedy Square. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Funding for this program furnished by Mary's Turner's Day Spa. Wilmington Road, Neshanic Township, Newcastle.
program was provided through funding from Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Cedars featuring Middle Eastern, Italian, and American cuisine. Sylvan Heights Golf Course in Newcastle, Pennsylvania features many amenities, lush fairways, and great greens, and many challenging shots. Your crowd will applaud. A short drive from Butler, Sharon, Pittsburgh, Elwood, and Youngstown. It's Sylvan Heights Golf Course in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. Hello friends and welcome once again to the Cedar Sports Corner and um, as we start going at this time of the year baseball starts to take center stage now um, you better get your afternoon nap because if you're gonna watch the Pirates they have a 10-10 start because they're out in San Diego now, Cleveland, on the other hand, has a 7-10 start, and they are up on the reservation taking on Baltimore. Elsewhere in the majors, you have the Yankees at home against Tampa Bay, the Mets on the road against Miami, Washington at home against Chicago, and the Rockies there at Philadelphia. Now the Dodgers will take on Cincinnati, the Giants will have Arizona, and the other late game will feature, will feature the Twins at Seattle. Now over in the NBA, and um, it's going to be crunch time, Toronto takes on Milwaukee in game two tonight, and over in the NHL, as they near the Stanley Cup and uh, my computer makes the change it is San Jose at St. Louis now uh, head over to Cedars get some great food enjoy the games a nice cold beverage and uh, hey lots of things going on in the greatest castle this weekend why not make it a holiday? We're going to take this time out. We'll be right back after this. service 347 East Washington Street Newcastle has lawnmowers of every type zero turn country clippers made in the USA 42 inch to 54 inch cut batteries by Oregon they'll service at your home or their shop service specials start as low as $69 call Jim Micko and Sons 724-652-6911 Well, uh, we're back, and um, not too bad of a transition there as uh, we're moving along. Saturday, down in Wampum, Hell's Hollow Hike, 1030 to 130. Hike is one of Wampum Chapter's fan favorites. Hell's Hollow parking available, and this starts from Harmony Baptist Church, 4103 Elwood Road. So, um, recapping as we go through what's going on during the week so that um, you got a pretty good idea of uh, all the activities. Now tonight, <clears throat> and, and I remind you again, that library stitchers is canceled uh, tonight St. Vitus night at the races tickets are $15 at the door it's at Mary Mother Hope Parish Center and uh, 
If you have any questions, call the school, 724-654-9297. Now, also tonight, if you're in that St. Vitus area on the south side, you know it's Maria Dalla Grazie, uh, the Rosary and May Crowning Friday, May 17th at 7 p.m. at St. Vitus. They'll have refreshments in Fabry Hall. Tomorrow, 5K John Thompson Run in the Shannon High School, and we're reminding you about that. We're also reminding you about Volant and their spring garden shops, and we're going to talk more about that on our n midday uh, news watch, our segment at noon. As, uh, like I said, just a whole lot of stuff going on. Urge you to get to the um, Warner Theater to check out what's going on down there. And uh, as we make the turn and go up through our notes, I don't want to leave anything out. I want to make sure that you have everything you need. And uh, what we're going to do now is I'm going to take a break we're going to hear from some sponsors and we're going to go to weather just so you get a look on what it's going to be like as you head out the door you know we told you earlier it was currently 61 degrees in Newcastle under really cloudy skies I would definitely take an umbrella today because I do believe you're going to get rain now uh, we're going to take this break and then go to 40 Lawrence County 45 weather and we'll be right back. Sylvan Heights Golf Course in Newcastle, Pennsylvania features many amenities, lush fairways, and great greens and many challenging shots your crowd will applaud a short drive from Butler, Sharon, Pittsburgh, Elwood and Youngstown it's Sylvan Heights Golf Course in Newcastle, Pennsylvania Tuscany Square Restaurant 3470 Wilmington Road where old world charm meets the modern conveniences of today Spacious seating and amenities await. Fresh ingredients that make that just right pizza or entree. It's Tuscany Square for your next event. Stop and see us or give us a call at 724-654-0365. Hello and welcome once again to Lawrence County 45 weather and uh, well what can I say beautiful day yesterday not so great last night after last night's rainy low of 59 and the rain was pouring down and how is your Friday looking well let's take a glimpse at local radar and off to the west and you can't see this there are showers and when you look at the national scene it looks a lot more ominous so how is your Friday shaping up mostly cloudy in 72 chance of rain 60 percent now that precipitation will die off as the night comes Friday night mostly cloudy in 52 and uh, showers should end by 10 o'clock on Saturday. Now, your Saturday, mostly cloudy, 76. And Saturday night, partly cloudy, low around 60. Sunday, mostly sunny in 83. And Sunday night, in clouds will build and uh, that'll create a mostly cloudy low of 63 with a 50 percent chance of rain monday partly sunny and 75 chance of rain goes to 40 percent and then monday night partly cloudy a low of 50. 
Tuesday, mostly sunny, a high near 70. Tuesday night, mostly cloudy, a low of 53. Wednesday, out pops the sun with a high of 76. And Wednesday night, mostly cloudy, a low of 58. Now, as you get, and Wednesday night, there's a 40% chance of rain. But as you get to Thursday, partly sunny, a high of 74. So that was Lawrence County 45 weather. We got to make it through this Friday, and then we'll kind of be okay. So uh, hang in there. That was Lawrence County 45 weather, and we're going to take this break. We'll be right back after we hear from these great sponsors. Standing by my Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Well, we're back, and uh, as I'm going through, uh, I'd like to uh, tell Bo to Carbo, uh, please give me a call. Um, I need to speak with you about something. And uh, that's going to do it for Newswatch Morning. Make sure that you tune in to Newswatch Midday. The morning show will be up right before that. And the return of showers and storms, really likely today. Make sure you have your rain gear and because um, you are going to get rain and it is going to be a lot. So uh, as you go through your day, make sure that you tell a friend about NCTV 45. They'll be glad you did. And uh, when they say, oh, I don't watch a lot of TV, tell them, don't worry, NCTV45, they're available anytime on your time. Yes, NCTV45, Newcastle's community television station, always in the pursuit of excellence, available anytime on your time. Now, make sure that you get that second cup of coffee and have a super day as you go up up and away and in the greatest castle in the world in the county of lawrence have a great day everybody and we'll see you again soon